Welcome to the desert. Oh my god, we gotta find a scarab. So, you can see this part of the game, uh, yeah, it never occurred in the movie. So it's got its own unique score, which is actually pretty good. Plus, this is the first point in the game where the animators or the designers got a chance to just do whatever the hell they wanted. So you can see things like the Mickey Mouse ears on strings in the background, or the giant fez-wearing snakes. Good times. By the way, I love this. I love the idea that a man scarfing down food can be killed by an apple. Also, the stop sign there is a nice touch. Yeah, this this level is really interesting. It actually has a pretty unique flow. Uh, lots of little hidden secret areas, and on top of that, they did a good job making it just very silly. I don't know where the Native American ruins come out in somewhere in the Middle East, wherever this takes place. You know, that's cool too. Doesn't have to make sense. There's genies and shit, right? Exactly. So, over here to the... I oh, thought there was another secret. So over here to the right, you can see that we have the first piece of the scarab. So we gotta find our way over there. Also, if you haven't been paying attention, those little black lamps blow everybody up. I don't know what they are. They look like they're supposed to be Jafar's lamp or something, but that doesn't make any sense. No, there's just... Sometimes there's just no sense to the power-ups in this, left, this game. What's up, fatty? Anyway, we get near the piece, and it flies away. Also, for some reason, those snakes can't be damaged by uh, apples. They can only be damaged by the sword, so take that into account, I guess, for whatever it's worth. So interestingly, this level's really short. We're actually almost done. Uh, we only have to collect that thing one more time, and we'll be out of here. Well, this game's obviously made for kids. You gotta love the little silly jokes like this, even though they're kind of ridiculous. Big-ass genie bathrooms with toilet paper on the outside. This is not really a joke, but whatever. I'll take it. Once we got the scarab, level is complete. Great. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah. So I think nine is the maximum amount of lives you can get, and aw, oh, fuck you, Jafar. So, creepy ass old man with ugly teeth who we randomly met now has us on a trip to find the second scarab in the possession of a thief. This also... nothing to do with the story. Awesome. See you next time.